Hello, my name is Tom Rossman, better known as Dr. Q. I've been a McDermott ambassador for over 30 years, and today I'm at the beautiful showroom factory at McDermott Q here in Menominee Falls, Wisconsin. They've just joined forces with a new venture called the Q Creator, one of the greatest innovations in Q production. So I want you to join me inside, out of the cold, into the warmth of the showroom to see what this is all about. choices in designing from the joint pin to the butt plate color. Under the inlay areas, there's also an upload section where you can add your own image to a white forearm and butt sleeve. I'd like to take you now on a tour of the factory showing the various stages and the processes for making your new cue. The first section is turning the centers where we will make the butt components. In this area, we turn the three sections of the butt, which are the butt sleeve, under wrap, and forearm. These three sections are made to the highest tolerances and are turned using our larger CNC lays. In our next stage, we deal with the CNC mills where we cut the pockets and inlays. Each queue has inlays and pockets in them, creating the greatest quality that we can provide. Our thickness of the inlays is far more superior to others in the industry. The inlays are glued together and are left for 30 days to rest before bringing them to the final size. We will now show you the third stage of production, the gluing of the butt together. The butt consists of three sections, the butt sleeve, under wrap, and forearm. Various bolts of different weights are used depending on what woods are selected to achieve the cue balance. The pieces are then assembled to the client's specifications. We are now ready to look at the shaft turning center. In this area, after checking the wood for blemishes, they are put through the CNC lays, and over a period of turning, then each shaft is checked for straightness, grain, and any marks in the wood. Shafts are then put through another CNC lathe to add the tenon for the ferrule. The next step in making our cue is the final turn of the bud and matching the butt to the shaft. Here we check the client's needs and fit the joints after first matching the butt to the shaft. A lot of care is taken to make sure we get everything perfect, for if it's not, it goes back to the production line. The stage we are at now is one of my favorites. It is the UV electrostatic spray booth for sealer and top coat. Each cue has a positive charge on the shaft and a negative charge on the paint which makes the urethane finish adhere to it very well. After this stage, the cues are hand sanded and then a final coat is applied. This area is so important to the overall depth and finish of the cue. We now move on to the wrap cutting for linen or leather and the wrap installation. The cue wraps may be chosen by the clients in finishes of Irish linen or leather. As you can see, there are many choices in colors. And last but not least, in the final step, we check the shaft for a perfect turn and the final quality control inspection. We check over each step to ensure that only the highest in quality leaves the factory. After this, it goes to the packing area, where they again check all the client specifications and check the quality for final dispatch. As you can see, Q Creator offers the best in workmanship McDermott's quality in manufacturing and the endless choices of woods and other materials makes this the best choice for your new queue. Your wood choices and other materials will make your queue personalized and very unique. So please check out the site at www.qcreator.com.